Hello, this is Dr. Lukes, and this is an example problem for continuous mass transfer. And we're looking at terminology for dryers and how we can apply that. And in this example, we have one kilogram blocks of wet borax laundry soap that have an initial co water content of 20.2 weight percent on a dry basis. And these will be dried with air in a tunnel dryer at one atmosphere. If the soap were brought to equilibrium with the air at 25 degrees C and a relative humidity of 20%, determine the mass of moisture evaporated from each block. So let's start by just figuring out that um, this 20.2% is on a dry basis. So what that means is that for every 100 kilograms of dry soap, I have 20.2 kilograms of water. And so if I were to put this on a wet basis, then 20.2 kilograms of water relates to 100 kilograms of dry soap plus that 20.2 kilograms of water. So. 120.2 kilograms of wet soap and so 0 0.168 is my mass fraction on a wet basis so initially if I have a one kilogram block of wet soap, then I'm going to use the 0 0.168 kilograms of water per kilogram of wet soap. And so therefore I have 0 0.168 kilograms of water. And the rest of this will be 0 0.832 kilograms of dry soap. So it's just using those definitions of wet and dry uh, uh, mass fractions. So this is how much we start with. Okay. The next question is asking how much is going to be in there after drying. Okay. So after drying, we're going to assume that this goes to the equilibrium moisture content. And to figure out the equilibrium moisture content, we're going to need the help of one of those graphs that we were looking at in class earlier. So in this particular case, we need one that's going to have soap. We have the relative Humidity is given as 20%, and so the graph that we want is this one. Now, soap is curve 8. Let me switch colors. So, curve 8. Um, actually, let me find 8 on this. Okay, so that you can try and find that. And we have relative humidity of 20%. We go up until we find this curve eight, and then read across. So at 20%, relative humidity for soap. What this tells me is that the equilibrium moisture content, we designate this with a capital X star, is about 0 0.037 pounds of water per pound of dry solids, or in this case, soap. And so this is the equilibrium content. 
If we want to know how much water is evaporated from each block, then we know that we have 0 0.832 uh, kilograms of dry soap. I'm going to multiply that by 0 0.037 kilograms of water per kilogram of dry soap. And this tells me that 0 0.030784 kilograms of water remain. And so the amount that was removed is the difference between the amount that we started with and the amount that remains. Sorry about that, a little typo. One, three, seven, two, that's enough. Kilograms of water will be removed for each one kilogram block of wet soap. So this concludes this little video demonstration of using this vocabulary. Thank you very much for your time.